The truth is I'm not good at everything in the desk and I have gaps in my own knowledge and my own workflow. But I wanted to create this series so that we all feel a little less alone and we'll all keep learning together. I would say that when it comes to organizing, which is, you know, a huge part of programming, it's all about data management. I fall so short when it comes to organizing my position presets. I have no idea why. I guess there's, I don't know, maybe no one's explained a workflow that's like clicked in my brain or I haven't had a moment where I'm like, this makes sense. Or maybe it's because I don't plan it out ahead of time when I just start putting things places and I just like quit caring because I'm so busy. I don't know. So my last show, I feel like it started well. I was like, okay, high straight, high fan, mid like crosses. There we go. And then I was like, okay, so we'll put some stuff for like the PXLs kind of in this area. And then it got like, I was like, well, I guess this is like, you know, key lighting esque. And then I'm like, I guess these two defaults will go here, but like, why is there a gap here? I don't know. I was saying, then we're here in the middle and I'm like, I don't even know what these are for. Oh, I guess they're also for a combination of the pixel curves and the solo picks. So I don't know, this doesn't have a cohesive manner. And then it actually, I found later in the programming process, I'd be like, where's that preset? And I could not find it. So this for me is like my next organizational plan. It's like, how do I keep this little group of presets something that's easier for me to find later on?